G'day Green Thumbs, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to clone a lemon tree, your favourite lemon tree. Now, my favourite is just over there and it is blooming. But you need to do this before it fruits. So here's what you do. You choose the, the freshest, sappiest ones and preferably no thorns. That is about one and a half hand spans tall. I'm going to get rid of the leaves on the bottom. Snip them off like so. All gone. So about that much of it is gone. I'm then going to put a nice little 45 degree cut in there. So I've got my cutting like that and I've taken off the bottom leaves like so. Now the remaining leaves, all you've got to do is just snip them in half. Now it looks brutal, but trust me, it's actually good for it. It'll encourage more vegetative growth and it'll prevent stress on those leaves so that they don't have to try and get nutrients all the way up to there and then sweat out the fluids at night. So all that water retention is going to come in handy because we've got no roots on this yet. So just snip leaves in half like so just get the crowns of the leaves off and there we have it so we've started off with something similar to that and we've got something like this now what to do once you've got that what do i do because i'm a lazy gardener i get a pot plant that's already got something growing in it and then in one corner i just Poke it down like so, give it a tap down, give that a water and watch that come to life. So that's pretty easy. I'm going to show you one that I did previously. So there's the uh, there's a chili plant with some weeds growing in the bottom. That's how lazy I am. And all I did was just poke this in. Now you'll notice the top leaves have been shaved off. But this thing has now got a root system. Now, I planted this about three months ago. So if it hasn't dried out in three months, it's in good nick. Now let's just have a quick look down the bottom. Oh yeah, that's, that's, that's in good nick that. Oh yeah. That's not coming out. That's very solid. So when I'm ready to relocate that, I will get that out of the pot, put that in a new pot, or put it in the ground somewhere, and away it goes. So that's how you turn your cuttings into plants. Easy as. All right, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget, if you've got any questions or comments, leave it at the bottom of the video. Give us a thumbs up or a like, and I will see you guys on the next one. And as always, may all your trees be full. Thanks for watching. Okay, viewers, that's me for another video. Now, you'll notice that there's no advertising on my videos. YouTube has changed the way they do things, so I'm now accepting Redcoin as a tip. So if you want to send a gift, a tip, or a donation, I've got the QR code at the end of this video. So just scan the code and send your red coins, your social tipping coin, straight to that address. Much appreciated. I'll try and see you on the next one.